If you want to win or with your friends in Monopoly, then you have arrived at the right place because this is how you are going to win in Monopoly. In this video, I'm going to take you guys through some steps and the steps are the following ones that are on the screen. The first step is the odds of dice. The chart that is on the screen right now tells you that 7 or a number close to 7 are most likely to be rolled on 2 dices. This could be very overpowered to predict where your opponents will land. Step number 2 is the cold and hot spots on the Monopoly board. Here you can see a map that uh, describes uh, the hot and cold spots very good. As you can see, the spots um, nearby Go is uh, not that good, but uh, especially the light blue and the orange gates are very hot. The fourth one is what color sets that are the best. I, I have actually mentioned this already, but the orange and the light blue color sets are the best. These two color sets are the best because they're the two that people are most likely to land on. Number five is houses and hotels. One thing that is important to know about houses in Monopoly is that houses on the first row after go cost 50 Monopoly money, row two costs 100, row three costs 150, and row four costs 200. Let's see how much it costs to build a hotel. But before you can build a hotel, you need to have four houses and a hotel costs as much as a house. So with basic math, you can multiply the house cost with five. So on row one, it will cost 250, row two, 500, row three, 750, and row four, 1000. It's also important to know with color sets uh, when you will get your money back of, of people landing on it. So I took the blue one, for instance, and uh, 1,750 Monopoly money It's what it costs to buy both the color set and a hotel. And if someone lands on the street one time, then you get all your money back. Step number six is all about trading. When you're trading, it is always important to remember how much money you and your opponent have. Let's look at a scenario here. Both you and your friend have 600 Monopoly money. You offer your friend the light blue and the orange gate, and you want to get 400 and the pink gate. Now your friend has only 200 Monopoly money and you have a thousand. That means that your friend can afford three houses and you can afford two hotels. You can afford pretty much more than your friend. Number seven is chance and community chest. Four of the cards is prison cards and in chance, most of the cards move you somewhere and in community chests, most of the cards give you money. Now we have learned some tips and tricks on how to win Monopoly and now I finally hope that you have a chance to play this game among your friends. And if this video was helpful in any way then I really recommend that you subscribe and like to this video. I have some other videos and I will upload every Wednesday but right now I upload it on a Tuesday but that's because this video took so long time to make and then I appreciate extra much if you like and subscribe. Goodbye!